By now, everyone and their grandmother knows what Lo-Fi is. If you have FL Studio, you definitely at one point thought to yourself, hey, I could totally make something like this. And then you try it and it's fucking garbage. Well, I'm here with the beginner's guide to help you become the next Lo-Fi star. And then you can annoy all your friends incessantly by linking them your SoundCloud account and forcing them to listen to all your shitty songs. And even though you know they didn't listen to it, they'll still text you and say, Hey man, that sounded pretty good. So if undeserved praise sounds like something that you would enjoy, then stick around. So just a really quick disclaimer, we're going to make happy lo-fi, meaning we're going to use C major. I feel like a lot of lo-fi is just kind of melancholy and depressing, and my life is really depressing enough. Also, we're not going to use any samples. I'll cover that in another video. So first things first... Well, hold on. This is very important. Yeah. Okay, that's better. Okay. Now we're going to look at our beat. First, you want these kicks that sound like they're falling over themselves. Then make sure your hats are doing this. Then layer it with another hat to make it sound funky. Now finally, you're going to want this broke-ass snare sound. I guarantee in about 99% of lo-fi you'll hear this, and since it's lo-fi, we just want to copy everyone else. Then layer it with whatever bullshit sounds you have laying around. Then just put all that shit together, and here you go. I almost forgot this is the most important thing when making a lo-fi beat. Go into your settings with whatever sound you have. I like to do the hats and adjust this shift knob a little bit. That literally just shifts it and gives it a little more bounce. But don't go too far because then you get this. It kind of just sounds like your beat tried to close on the bar, so we don't want that. Next thing we're going to look at is the instrumental, and since this is a no sample run, we're just going to use a piano sound, and we're going to fuck with it to make it sound like it's old. So before you ask, do we need music theory? No, we do not need to know music theory. For us musically challenged people, we're going to pick the key of C. Now why would we pick that? Well, you know those black keys that are in between the white keys, and they're skinny, and they're hard to hit, and it's just really confusing? Well, the key of C has none of that, and we could just mash our hands like a monkey on all the white keys, and it'll sound okay. See? That doesn't sound like total trash. In fact... That'll be our chord progression. So also what we're going to do here is, see I have piano low and piano high. Just copy one of these tracks and then go to your piano roll for another one and then just put it an octave above your low. And if people say, hey, you don't play piano like this. Speaking of making it sound like trash, you definitely 100% need isotope vinyl. Iso isotope? Isotope vinyl. I mean, seriously, listen to what you could do with this. It's great, and if you're a poor bastard like me, good news, it's free. So now we have our chords and our beat, and the last thing we have to do is just solo over that to make it sound a little more interesting. And it's good because we picked the key of C, so we could just mindlessly hit all the white keys until it sounds good. Then to give it just a little more flavor, I got this whistle sound from the DS-77. And then I just played that again over the chords, just to switch it up a little bit. 
So then you just kind of put that all together and arrange it, and there you go. Then just slap a vinyl sound under it, just so it sounds like we're playing off a record. Finally, the most important step of making this song, you're going to go to your master channel, go to Maximus, presets, fancy, and lo-fi. There you go. And then just adjust this knob for how lo-fi you want it. I don't really think that this is the proper way to use it, but again, when it's all said and done, it should sound something like this. <laughs> 